Good day everyone, this is Hobmas welcoming you back to the channel. As always, wishing you all the very best. So I'm back again this time with an upgrade kit for the Studio Series 102 Rise of the Beast Voyager Optimus Prime. Now, as you may have seen in one of my other videos, I had the gun upgrades, which were about 10, 12 pounds. They weren't very dear, but they gave them that extra bit, but it still had the one bugging issue, which we'll get to which, as you can obviously tell, it fixed. But as always, we'll start with the packaging. It says DNA Designs, and it says, you've got a lovely picture of Noah there, saying DK44 Studio Series 102 Upgrade Kit, age, e dad, e daddy 16 plus. You've got all your bits, saying made in China, do not eat this, it will kill you. And it shows you all the bits in the box. So as you can see, you get two replacement direct replacements for the original standard blade but now it comes with glowing orange and it has two axes with a glowing edge of orange as you can see and they even threw in a purple blade almost like a dark energon megatron version and you got a purple axe so and it comes with the shoulder upgrades but as you can see here I have got a gripe with this kit uh, it's supposed to come with two of these red as you can see on the figure mine only came with one so i've messaged the seller see if they can sort me out a replacement because it cost enough so i expect it to be replaced uh but that being said that's that so let's get the box out of the way they did send a shed load where are they? i think there was two of each oh no uh a sheet of transformer stickers which are always good for you if you've got third parties and you do get instructions as you can see so it's all good and it shows you that you can store weapons on the back and everything but we'll get to that so as you can see is the kit some of the bits on here are the new bits like the axes and get all the new bits out I've already changed all the bits over so there's all the old bits that you replace so as you can see you get some blast effects which are for the gun and for Noah's back he has no articulation but my god he is the correct scale compared to the core class version and these are hitches for the trailer for Earthrise Kingdom trailer and as you can see here let's move that because nearly knocked Optimus off his perch you get two axes that have got a nice translucent glow and this is the standard blade and if you put it next to that you can see this one has the red hot edges which looks way better and as i said she comes with extra bits there and it does come that's not all it does come with two of the cannons but annoyingly they've made them both for the same arm so you probably could jimmy rig one if you're not bothered about them being symmetrical you can have one that way one that way but i'm sure if you undid all these bits carefully and glued them back on you probably could swap them around because I do think they all just click in on the same ports oh no different sizes so no ignore that do not do that you'll wreck it just keep it and there you go so let's get down to the bot to Mr Optimus Prime there we go my name is Optimus Prime and as you can see 
not going to go too much into detail with bits and bobs because obviously if you've seen my review which i hope you have i hope you enjoyed it you'll look, gather what the differences are so if you look at him standard like that he looks pretty similar apart from now he has a double toe joint and again on the other foot I mean I've seen some other reviews and reviewers are saying oh my feet are loose but I've just been lucky because mine are not loose mine are pretty solid he doesn't fall over he can stand there all day long and as you can see the blades look really nice just saucy and they just click in as normal and again you can just click them on the back if you don't want them on and the smaller holes there you go storage which is always an option and then obviously the big upgrade on this as I've said problem is mine only came with one of these didn't come with both the reds so I've emailed the seller to see if they can get me one but it does come with smaller smokestacks that are painted better and you can angle them back so it's more true to the film and one massive massive thing for me this is now my favorite figure because you know what's coming if you followed me one thing that bugged me with this amazing figure was the shoulders where it just smacked himself in the head but look bang boosh there you go beautiful bala bing bala boom he's now got decent articulation on the shoulder so thank you dna i mean this side is really tight and it tries to move that other joint as you can see tolerance on it is very snug but i don't care it'll wear itself off in time hopefully not snap the joint which i don't think it will but you just literally assemble that you have to, you do have to take this piece off the other arm and this bit here comes off the other arm but other than that i mean just look at that that is way better than smacking himself on the head i mean it still goes up but you've now got where you can actually articulate him in some decent poses so they've definitely done well there i mean there is other upgrade kits out there but i recommend this one totally i got a valley express 38 and then the other upgrade is these bits on the legs which couple together in truck mode you just pull off the old bits which are up there pop these on same as the feet you just pop them off and then like here there's a little port there which just goes in and it just clicks together nice and snug makes the legs really solid such a good figure such a good figure and as i say it does come with noah so noah could sit on his shoulder he is not he is not alone and there you go he's on his head and to comparison i don't even think i've done the review for this yet this is my scourge with the funny thing is this is a dna upgrade kit that optimus has which costs nearly 40 pounds the one that came for scourge was 12 pounds and it came with the correct head swappable face plates and everything that was off aliexpress and he has articulated hands and he has a device which poisons air razor spoiler if you've not seen the film and it has all the leg upgrade kits makes him the chunky boy he's supposed to be and that is sharp but let's do our comparison to old uh, prime why is he not wanting to stand he's a, he is a heavy boy scourge there you go so as you can see scale so they do go together rather well and like i said he does come with his axes but you do have to pull the bottom off to get the axe in the hand and then just click it in but you see he's now got his axe where he could be going to fight and you can utilize that extra joint getting him in some battle poses give me your face there you go and he did it he took him out see look at that magic of television but there you go see really really good you will need one of these sort of screwdrivers or a very small one i mean i got this for a couple of pounds from asda 
multi-tool heads and I use these now on all my I got it specifically for the channel for my upgrade kit but yep yeah, so we'll show you what the gun looks like now we're hanging on for dear life there There you go. Posability is freaking sweet. Now, let's see. Because apparently you can click these on there. But it's not normal bluish effect. But you can use that if you want. So we can go buy a scourge. And he's down. So, yep. Yeah. yeah. So it's pretty cool. You know what I mean? I mean articulation and everything now has been improved this is the how hasbro should have made it it's a really really fecking annoying that we had to do the up wait for dna design to do upgrade kits to fix things that hasbro just don't bother to do the amount of money that they pay i mean i have got fellow youtubers that go oh it's all about the engineer yeah but the engineering's not there sometimes the engineering should be there and it isn't like on this that would have been such an easy fix they could have done that we shouldn't, I shouldn't have had to pay for the kit, but it's good that there's companies out there that do it. But they should have given him his gun, like this. He should have had that, but they didn't. And it, it's just freaking annoying, because it's like you pay a decent penny for these, and they're getting dearer and dearer every year. And they know money's tough, and they know they've got business to run, but it surely won't cost that much more just to give you that little bit extra. But you know what I mean? You can get him into some right dynamic poses now. He looks so much better. And like I said, that bluish effect didn't show you. Oh, I wonder if I can get it out of the packet. Sticks in Noah's back. So when he's on the back of Prime at the end scene, he's just blasting away. <laughs> So you know what I mean? So he scales perfect now. I mean, the core class one I've got, but it's too big. So this Noah will be going in my display. I mean, I know there's a Bayway kit out there that does have an articulated Noah. I might still pick that up just for him, but this will do. So, yep. I'm going to get him into truck mode, and then I'll show you all the bits and bobs, how he looks in truck mode. Yeah. A few moments later. And... Welcome back. And as you can see, Prime is now in his truck mode, very similar to the Earth Rise Kingdom mode. It all packs up nicely. And as you can see, this is the only thing that's annoying, because obviously that's grey. They replaced this with red to make it look better, but obviously, like I say, mine didn't come with two, so I've had to make do with one and one. So I'll probably change it back to the grey. But that aside, you can now position the smoke stacks how you want them, going backwards. Sticking outwards, it's entirely up to you. Exactly how you want them. And he does have, now on the back, he looks so much tidier. I mean, yeah, it would have been nice if the feet, you know, and that just folded in there, then it's a lot cleaner. But, you know, it is what it is. You can't have it all, and it's still better than what we got before. And it pegs together now underneath to make him a bit more tougher bit more and you still have the same issue as you do with all the other versions of these that they've utilized that bit with the legs where they just fall in all the time unfortunately but now it does come with this adapter which if you've got the kingdom earth rise trailer you can now do that scene from the end of bumblebee movie where prime is rolling out of his trailer so you know what that is freaking sweet and you could have noah on top giving him that extra boost rolling out <sighs> do you know what I mean so it looks pretty good and I'm not missing a bit I know the bit goes there for inside but uh, it's on my figure so I've left it on it but apparently you can store these bits in here supposedly I'm trying to work out where Hmm. 
So no, it has stated that the weapons can click together. Like you see these little nodules here. These little pins push through. And you can push that through there. Push it through a little bit more. It says you should. There we go. Get the pin through a bit more. Hmm. Oh, hang on. I'm being daft. It's this. All right, there you go. So then now, you can store that there. I'm being absolute drongo, I apologize, viewers. Oh, this is tough. There you go, I had to force it on my review table. But as you can see, that goes there. And now you can put the gun there, which knocks all the bits off, which is annoying. You can hear an ice cream van in the background. I apologize. It will sit in there, it's just a bit loosey-loosey. Try and get this to go in nice and steady. Oh, a bit of my gums come out. Let's just chuff that, boys and girls. There we go. We'll just have it like that. Because a bit of my guns decided to fall off. There we go. But yeah, you're supposed to be able to click that in there. But there you go. You've got weapon storage. And again, you've got your existing standard blade. That due to ports. You can also chuck that in there. So, which does fall off because it's a dick. There you go, just shove that in there. But like now, trailer is closed. And hitched up. So there you go. And you could, if you just want to chuck all your bits inside so you don't lose them. Even little Noah can just go for a ride. You can just chuck them all in, close it up. Autobots transform and roll out. But yep, does transform rather nice. And now, I think we have a true depiction of a modern Prime and my favourite. So definitely definitely good like i said it's just annoying that it turned up any one of them because the red does look way better but yeah there you go beautiful and i've just thought all this time there we go as you can see let there be light looks beautiful beautiful and it rolls well just looks so good so so good so there you go have it where Scourge is about to attack him while he's or oh, he can even take Scourge for a ride Wee! <laughs> there you go right I'm going to go to my final thoughts I hope you'll join me yeah welcome back to my final thoughts I'm going to give this kit 9 out of 10 it is a very good kit the only reason it's getting 9 out of 10 instead of 10 out of 10 is because it arrived with a piece missing which is freaking annoying 
when I paid all that money and it should come complete but I'm hoping the seller's decent enough to sort it uh, if not I'll just have to swap the other one back to the grey one but that being said it is a good kit I mean they do charge quite a bit but they've got to make these kits and it's worth it in the end I mean at the end of the day you think about it with the kit and that this figure was like nearly £70 which is a lot for a main line but he's how I want him to be so I will accept that so I got this off AliExpress and like I say it was £38 well worth it check it out please check out the other videos in the channel and again thanking you all and till next time this is your boy Hobmus saying I've enjoyed reviewing the DNA Design DK44 Studio Series 102 upgrade kit for Rise of the Beast Optimus Prime. And I've enjoyed it. Till next time, Scooby-Doo ending. Till all toilet was a one. <laughs>